my gosh. Look at her. What's up, everybody? I'm Mike. This is Mary. That's Mary. Mary That's Mary. Nick. And this is The Game House. Tonight on the Game House, Mary has selected Honey Buzz for us to play. Don't you love this game, Mary? Make it. Make it. Okay. I'm not, not a I am not a tool off. for you to make money. <laughs> <laughs> We're playing Honey Buzz. This is a game about animals that make money, like our animal makes us money. Oh, mm -hmm. precious. Uh, this is about bees that like economics and stuff. Bee economics, if you will. Uh, and it's uh, adorable, one of the best produced games ever. It's so beautiful. It's We're gonna play this for you, but first let's take you down to the table, show you a little bit of an overview of Honey Buzz. In Honey Buzz, players take on the roles of bees who are working hard to build their hive and produce honey to sell to hungry animals. Each turn, the active player will play one or more bees to the central board to acquire a hive tile. This hive tile will be added to their hive and if they complete an empty cell, they get to take all the actions in the spaces surrounding that cell. They can take these actions in any order they choose and they allow for bees to forage for nectar tiles or pollen, gain new bees, produce honey with a fan action, and do market actions. When doing a market action, a player may sell all of one type of honey or pollen to the market for the current market rate and then decrease the value of that product. Instead, a player can complete an order from an animal. When they do this, they earn money at the end of the game and they get to take a bonus action. Players will continue to play, adding on to their hive until two stacks of orders are empty or until four of the five market items have dropped to their lowest value. Players then add up their money earned from contracts and score any Queen's Contest cards and a player with the most money wins. Mike, this is your favorite game about honey. Hey, what's the buzz? Hey, hey what's the buzz? It's just in the hive. We saw some guys making nectar. What's up with that? We're going to sell that a while. <laughs> Uh, this is Honey Buzz about bee economics. That's what that impersonation was. If you didn't see a bee accountant when I did that, well, it was originally a Goodfellas the... theme, and they decided to change it to bees because they, they were like, eh, let's so keep it a little more, a little more family stuff. friendly. We can't do that. Yeah. This is Honey Buzz. We are bees. We've discovered money yeah. and capitalism. We're here to sell this pollen and nectar. Well, while these to animals the kept stealing bidders. our honey, so we're like, look at the here's the thing. Listen, we'll set up a little shop. We'll sell it to Simple. them. We make some money. Five cents. And they stop destroying our hives. Boom. It's a win-win-win. It really is. It's a smart idea. Everybody wins. You've got one bee to start. You are the first player since you have that the honey dipper thing. Honey right? dipper. What 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 is this? What are these called? People help us out. Honey stick. No. But does the honey go in here? Yeah. It like catches it, and then you you know you swirl it about in your coffee or whatever. I don't know how this. I don't works. understand how this works. I don't understand bee technology. Someone is, you know more about my. Like, give me one bee fact. Uh, okay. Mike does so know a lot about bees. My my go to with this, I do know a lot about bees. My go to with this is every single bee that you have ever seen in the wild, and I do mean every single one yeah. is a female. There's not one rogue male out there. You've never seen a rogue male bee. It just doesn't happen. Yep. They don't leave the hive. They don't do every nothing. bee. They're they don't. They, they don't. They're yeah. worthless in the bee community. They do one thing: help the queen make more bees. That's, That's about it. it. That's all they do. And every just, bee you've ever seen, die every afterwards. single bee you've ever seen is a female. It's awesome. Very cool. Yeah. That's my go to. They also talk through dance. And royal jelly, I hear. There is royal jelly. Yeah. They do. They, they the stage first three coups days, constantly. I feel like they're they always in the middle of They think this bee's going to be strong. This bee's going to be a queen. They give it more royal jelly. How do they know, Bees though? stage coups. How do they do that? How they do they do overthrows? Like, this is it. This one's the bee. Dude, give it some royal jelly. I don't know. It's one of the <laughs> mysteries. Like, this bees, bee has I, I listened to a book about called like uh, The Democracy of Bees, talking about how they, yep. how they choose hives. Yes. And it was fascinating how yes. democratic they are and yep. how they always make the right decision. And they have like debates. It's Bees are amazing. Bees are incredible. Save the bees, please. Save we bees. need bees. And we, poly, other pollinators. Don't get rid of like ugly plants if they're good pollinators. Because we, we need those. We won't make it far without them. Nick, let's play some Monarch butterflies are dying. Just saying it. It's, it's sad. They only eat milk thistle. Stop getting rid of your milk thistle. <laughs> this is true. I think. I think it's milk thistle. Nonetheless, this is Honey Buzz. It's a great game. Uh, what, what did we first saw this at PAX a minute ago, right? A very long time ago. Been, yeah, we demoed it at PAX. PAX Unplugged 2019. Right. 2019, before times. Okay, so I am first player. I was so seated here. Paula Deming was seated to my right. That is true. That was true. So I have one bee. You can go to these different spots here. And again, this is one spot. You're collecting tiles. We're ultimately building out a hive to... Activate actions. Is yes. What, what we're, is, you'll you'll see in a moment, I imagine. Oof. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure what to do here. Let's go ahead and go... I don't know. Uh, let's just go here. I'm just going to get five buckarunos straight up. All we're right. going to go... Blam. 
All right, so once you complete a cell, Nick will activate anything that's around those cells. So you It's kinda, a very cool action selection system. Yeah, it's very cool. So I'm gonna demonstrate right here. I'm actually gonna go right here and take this little tile that has foraging on it. And um, you know what I'm gonna do is actually I'm gonna flip it around this way. Mm -hmm. And you're wasting, like you're so. wasting that. Yeah, so now I've completed a cell, meaning that there were this little negative void hex has been created. So I am going to be able to activate everything that is around this hex. So these three actions, I can do it in whatever order I want. Mm -hmm. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a little newbie. Newbie, <laughs> a newbie. It's gonna go to the nursery right there. So when I recall my workers, I'll get that bee along with my others. This is a decree. This basically is a wild. You can treat it as any of the other actions. And I'm gonna make this a forage yeah, action, which sense. goes over here. We have our little scout bees. Uh, and they can move around and collect these uh, nectar tiles. So I'm just gonna move one space in like so. And I'm gonna collect this nectar. If you're curious, we do we did get upgraded bits for this game. We do. We have some upgraded bits. These being some of them, very nice, very nice. So to make to collect these nectar, so you have to make a kind of a pattern that matches here. So in mm -hmm. this case, you need to have two reds and then four white going around like so. I made a match right there, which gives me the acacia, the ability to make acacia nectar. And then my last thing I'm gonna do is a fan. So this fan helps me produce nectar. You have to put it adjacent to uh, really anywhere in your hive, but if it's adjacent to any of these and they don't have a nectar on them, you produce one of that nectar and it goes right there. Boop, boop. That's it, it's my first turn. Okay, uh, I, I am like gonna recall, productive. I have to recall. If I recall, if I recall you are a bee. I'm just gonna move, uh, and you can move one You can choose your starting recall. position and stuff, so make sure. I'm, I may not move actually. You don't have to. No, actually, I'm gonna move here. I'm gonna move here. Yeah, you get a free move. You don't actually when take you recall, the yeah. So I'm gonna be back. Okay. All right, I'm gonna take my workers back. So again, I'll get my new bee along with my other bee. It's good to have more workers because if Nick had gone to an action space and I want to go there, I then need to make a bee line and put two. If he had put one there, then the next person's put three. So you want a pool of workers if you Indeed. can get it. Okay. And now I'm gonna go. Mm, let's go here. I'm gonna get a one of these, and I'm gonna. Go mirror like that. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna use my decree. I'm gonna kind of do a similar thing that you did right here. I'm gonna use my decree action to forage one spot forward, and I'm gonna take this acacia as well. And that's gonna go right in there. I'm gonna get two newbies. Boop boop. Into there, and then I'll get a fan, and I'm also gonna fan this acacia. And so you get have to cool down when the bees come in. All right, they have, a, they have a honey stomach. They have two stomachs, right? And so they have a honey stomach. They've gone out and gotten it from, you know, nectar from, plant, from plants and flowers and things. And they go, and I'm not gonna lie to you, they barf it up. You are eating bee puke. Honey is bee barf. Facts. That's a fact. So it comes in, it's too hot, and they literally fan and cool down the hive. They can aerate the hive and, and regulate temperature, but they will cool down the honey, mm -hmm. or the nectar, and make it into honey awesome. and stuff, and cap it off and let it sit and all. They're amazing creatures. Bees are incredible. All right, so um, the fan is accurate, scientifically, so you know. Um, all right, and that's it. Okay, I'm going to, so you got a new bee. Um, I would love to do this. I'm gonna take the fan action tile, and I'm gonna plop it down right here and create another empty cell. Ooh, all um, right. And this is going to get me a new bee. So I'll put this in the nursery. I will do a forage action. I'm going to uh, go straight down and collect this. You could also collect pollen if you didn't take one of these, but I can take this right here. Boom, and then a fan action. I will once again fan. If this was the case where I didn't have a nectar here and this is adjacent to two, it would produce on both. But yeah. each one can only hold one nectar, so I'll get just the one new one, which is wildflower. Indeed. Beautiful. Beautiful. Alrighty. Good. Okay, I am gonna recall my bees. I am not gonna move my uh, forage. Sure. A forage bee. Okay. Um, okay. I would love, what am I trying to do here? I do kind of, okay, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go here, down here, and get one of these little accounting. Uh, do some number crunching. And I'm gonna plop this right down here, which completes a cell. I have two forage actions. When you have two forage actions, they are 
considered separately mm -hmm. two actions. And each action you can move one and then pay money to move further. Yep. So I'm gonna move forward one space and collect this nectar token. Um, and then I'm in a situation where no matter where I move, I can't collect, I don't have another space for another nectar token. So I'm just gonna move forward one spot and instead collect a pollen. Mm -hmm. These little pollen backpacks, which are on the upgraded bits, and they are adorable. They are adorable. So I'll okay, take a little pollen for myself. Okay. Uh, I'm going to put two bees out. Uh, I got $5 for my accounting. That's right. I'm going to put two bees out here. And again, they have to be more because Mike already has me. I'm going to get a fan. Um, and I am going to put this right here and complete a cell just like that. Nice. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get a new bee. Boom. Right there. I'm going to go ahead and get $5 hairs. Um, I will get a foraging action. I'm gonna move forward one and grab this. Okay. Boom. And then I can also fan them and I'm gonna go ahead and go boop and I'll just get a uh, rosemary nectar. Bam. Okay. okay. Hmm. Need to make something here myself. Um, I don't have any bees. Uh, well, I'm gonna recall my bees right now. Yes, so. Um, I think I might actually scooch back here with my uh, scouting for nectar action. Okay. I'll recall. Ooh, ooh. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? Be a bee today. Be a bee today. I'm gonna go right there. Okay. I'm gonna go. Up uh, here, snag this. I'm gonna go like so. Nice. Uh, we'll call my bees. Boop. Okay. Boop. I am not gonna move my my forage bay. Okay. Forage bay. Um, I'm gonna do. Ooh. This is my forage bee. His this name is, is Wigglesby the Fortage Bee. There are many that are like him, but this one is mine. <laughs> uh, I'm going to take this and get a newbie. I'm going to throw this in right here, which will complete a cell. So I'm going to activate. I'm going to do a forage action. I will take this, which has to have kind of two red on either side, flanking the yellows like so. Um, so that's my forage action. I will get a newbie. Goes to the nursery. The nurse bee. Nurse bee. Uh, and then I will go here and produce with the fan action and get me one of these cherry blossoms. Hello. Oh, delicious. Delicious. I'm going to go here. I'm going to get a fan. Um, I'll put it right there. I completed this one right here. So I am going to do a forage action. And I am going to get this cherry blossom right here. Put it in there like blam. Um, and then I can... A fan, where's the fans? Fan, put fan right here. I'm just gonna get a cherry blossom honey. Okay. I am going to uh, fulfill an order, and I can fulfill one of the orders are face up here. I can fulfill either. Or you can one. sell directly to the market. Or you can sell, yeah, your honey or and or pollen directly to the market. I'm gonna get this one because it's worth more points. It's gonna take a cherry blossom love that. and an acacia. Boom. And that's just gonna come to me. Flip that one over. So this also right here is a pollen, which is again, one of those. Um, and then I have a decree. I'm gonna fan again, and I'm just gonna boom, put a fan right there, and I'm gonna get those two hones back. Yeah, it's the nice thing when you do these, you get you know a bonus action to do on top of the market action. Oh, so cool. I actually, I'm sorry, I don't actually need to do that. I was, I was using this decree to fan, I oh, forgot yeah. you got that. Okay, I'll so I'm gonna that. use this decree to, no, no take back, because you took your finger off the chest piece. I'm gonna do my decree to do this. You got wreck, nerd! And this order right here. I'm gonna do a cherry blossom and a rosemary. I'm gonna get this order as well. Why do I suggest? Which I love when you do that. Every game, I feel like there's some point where I say something that just like, oh, thanks for the 10 points. I'm like, why thanks did for I? the 86 points. And then I'm gonna get to do a forge. Actually, I'm just gonna move here and get to Pulan. Thank you. Hold on. Thank you for the money. Mm. And Mikey, when does the game end? The game is going to end when two of these three stacks are depleted. Yep. Or when 
four of the five types of uh, nectar or pollen have reached the bottom of the market. Because if you sell directly to the market, never done that. you're gonna deplete, you're flooding sure. the market with products. You're gonna lower the value of that. Normally it comes down We've to this. never done that. <laughs> no. And then also, for the things that we're going for here, these are some kind of like um, object, object, public objectives yep. we're kind of going for. At the end of the game, the fewest workers will get the 20 points. Most empty cells in like a straight line will get 20 points. And then this one is during the game, it's kind of a race. Two nectar each of any two types, which I have a hunch. You already got two of one kind. I'm closer I'm to that Kind one. of falling behind on that one. These were 20 points. So these are worth a lot of points. Sure. I will say. Uh, I'm going to go over here, Nick, and snag this. And um, I think I'll just go like so. Like there. Okay, I am going to, where's, I'm gonna go double B right there. I'm gonna get this right here. Okay. And we're gonna go blam right there. That fills in, so I'm gonna get two more Bs. Uh, and then a forage action, I'm gonna Go over here and take this one right here, put it in there, shuflak, boom. Okay, I have to recall, so I'll get my bees back, including a new bee. And um, I don't think I'll move my my scout. Okay, um, I have one bee left. What do I want to do? Erm. Let's do this one right near. We're gonna put this right near. Mm. Okay, did this right here, so I'm gonna go ahead and just get five or money. Acorns, if you ask a squirrel, is money. Is money, and then I'm gonna move, oh, wait, what did I just do? You can tell that squirrels don't oh. believe in banks, that's why they pack it into their cheeks. That's so right. They're like, yeah. <laughs> keep my money under a mattress, bro, right up in these gums. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Um, and so I did that, so I have a forage, got this one right here. I am going to fan, and I am gonna fan right here, and I'm gonna get two of the cherry blossoms, and then one rosemary. Excuse me. Boom. Hmm. Boom. Boom, and then I can complete an order. I'm gonna go ahead and complete this one, which is gonna be a cherry blossom, an acacia, and then a pollen. Boom, and that allows me to uh, fan. I'm gonna go ahead and fan over here. I'm gonna get a wildflower and that acacia back. Boom. Very nice. <laughs> I'm not doing nearly enough. I'm gonna lose real bad. <laughs> I don't know about that. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good about that. <laughs> um, my life just got ruined, baby. It yeah, problems, a lot of my actions are kind of, one really cool about the game is like, you don't wanna like block off you end up closing off your actions. And yeah. so you constantly have the to only like, will activate so many times. Yeah, and so it's it's kind of, you get big clusters of actions. That usually means that on the outskirts there's not that many actions. And so like, it's it can be kind of interesting. Yeah, you have to kind of build back up. All right, I'm gonna complete that right there. And, um, yeah. All right, so I'm gonna do a forage action. And I'm gonna go one space here, and I'm actually gonna pay four dollars to move further. Ooh. I'm gonna go up here and then up here, so nice. I can take this ultimately. Nice. I don't plan well. Bees plan well, but I do not. <laughs> but I do not. Um, and then I'm going to do my fan action next, and I'm gonna plop it right here and produce. Produce a wildflower and an acacia, which gives me two nectar of two different types, which means I have won the race to grab this, yep. which I desperately need the money. So thank you very much for that. Yeah, knew it wasn't gonna. Um, yeah, I needed. I really. Well, I, I, I kind of started getting something. Going. I started getting closer, so I was like, "Well, if you don't do it the next turn or two, I'm gonna start going for it." But then yeah. I was like, "Yeah, okay, that makes sense." Yeah, I saw that. I was like, "Okay, I got five dollars from my accounting, and then I can do a market action if I please." Um, and you know what? I'm just gonna do. Do that can forage, forage for porridge. <laughs> um, well, I suppose this is the only contract I can do right here. So I will turn in a uh, acacia and a wildflower. Complete this, give this little raccoon some honey. <laughs> um, this will allow me to do another market action as a bonus action. Be there, 
Ooh, close, close, very close actually. Um, but you know what I'm gonna do instead is I'm just going to sell, uh, I'm gonna sell this acacia right here, just to the market for seven bucks, that will lower the value of that good. But you know, money's good in hand. We wanna have money, money one way or another. If I sell the market, if I complete contracts, money is money. Money is money. Okay. Uh, I have to recall. Money boom, is my boom, business, boom. bees. <laughs> and business is good. Let's simplify that one. Me? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Could I, should I move? No, I'm fine. It's up to you. No, I'm good. Woo! Well, then, think about it. Yeah, I'm going to move here. Um, okay, I'm going to four hours. Take this four hours. Yeah, but, sir? You're moving me. You know this is not you. I didn't know that. Now I know that. Do you want to move Then I your definitely don't want to move. Okay. No, I don't. I would love if you did move mine. That'd be great for me. Uh, I'm going to go like so and complete a sell. This will give me a newbie. There's my bees. Um, I will do a forage action and go straight down and just get a pollen. And then I will do a fan action to Purduke. And... I will do that right there and produce a wildflower and an acacia. Acacia. Boop, boop. All right. Um, I'm going to spend five bucks. You wouldn't go dare. Go here and get a decree. You have to spend five dollars to get this one because it's wild. wild action. It's quite powerful. Um, I am going to get that five bucks back. It's also one of the reasons why I did it. Mm. I can fan. I'm just gonna fan uh, right here. I suppose I'm just gonna get that cherry blossom back. And then for my decree, what should I do? I think I'm just gonna go ahead and fill an order. I'm gonna do this one, which will take a wildflower, a cherry blossom, and then a rosemary. Boom. That'll allow me to do a um, forage wow. action. Um, I'll just move here, and I'll just get a pollen, though. Okay, nice. Uh, I'll go down here, Nick, and I will take this market tile. I'm gonna plop it down right so. Right so. Um, or no, do I want to do that? I suppose I could. I suppose I could. I have all my bees everywhere, so it's, I only have one bee. I could, I could recall my bees as well. Let's go for this. All right, so I'm gonna do this. Uh, I have the ability to do two market actions. Nice. Uh, and a fan action. So I'll start off with a market action, and I'm gonna sell to the uh, friend over here on the barrel. Uh, boom, it's gonna be two wildflower and an acacia. That'll give me $9, a little squirrel friends. Um, and that's going to give me a bonus market action. Actually, I have two more market actions. First thing Oof. I'm gonna do is produce right here. And get two wildflower and an acacia back from yep. the fan. Um, oh, you know what? I probably have to do that market action immediately. I'm gonna sell these two pollen from that. That's fair. Uh, mm -hmm. So it'll be six and six is twelve. I mean, yeah, you're you're making a lot of money that now way. Now I'm doing my fan action. Ooh. Um. And then for my final market action, I'm going to sell some wildflower. I'll sell two wildflowers. They're currently worth $5. So it'll be 10 bucks for some wildflowers. And then they lower in value as well. Mm -hmm. Nice. Just selling. Flooding the market with product, It's not man. a bad idea. That's a ton of points. You just got like a crazy amount of points. So that's not a bad idea. Yeah. Um, I am going uh, to... Just calling my agents. I'm like, stock market's going to crash, yeah, man. You got to sell, sell, down. sell, sell. You're like, you want me to make a B sell? I'm like, no, sell the honey from the cells. I can't be more clear than that, man. <laughs> I cannot be more... Just make the sales! <laughs> Do it! <laughs> I want to go... He... I guess sell the stuff, man. <laughs> got to move the product. What is considered a straight line for this? Um... So like, is this, I guess that's a straight line? Yeah. yeah? Okay, I'm just making sure. <laughs> I was gonna do a comment that was definitely gonna get the face on, but I was gonna be like, so you've seen a straight road, right? Have you ever made a bright turn? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. I was like, but yes. I, I, I have to do, I was like, yeah, Nick, that's definitely what that is. I'm gonna go here and just get a pollen. 
uh, for my forage action. I'm like, beep, 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 beep. this ain't, we don't have this area. Oh, okay, I'll go here and then you'll pull it. There you go. Um, Same difference. And then I will fan. Where do I want to fan? I'm going, ooh, I'm going to go fanning right here. I'm going to go boom and boom. And then I'll complete a market order. I'm going to go ahead and do this one, which is going to be a wildflower, an acacia. I'm sorry, cherry blossom and then an acacia. Nice. And that'll be this one. That allows me to do another market order. Oof. Damn, close to another one. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and sell this rosemary then for uh, six bucks. Okay. Okay. I have to recall my bees. That's it. Okay. Um, I am going to go here. Okay. And I'm going to put this right there. Uh, and then I can go ahead and fan because I completed this. I'm just going to go boop, put that fan right back where it was. Get an acacia, a rosemary, and a wildflower. And then I'm going to go ahead and sell, and I'm going to do this one. <gasps> no. Which is going to be a wildflower, an acacia, and then a pollen. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, that's not good. That's going to be that one. And then I can do a forage action. I guess I'll just go boop and get another pollen. This is the part where I desperately check to see if I get another turn. <laughs> Quick. Oh, God. Oh, I am second player, right? Yep, thank goodness. <laughs> Whew. Crisis averted. Um, Crisis averted. Okay, so the thing is, is thank you're gonna God. win that cell one now. So yep. that's a foregone conclusion. Um. Let me think about it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, goodness. Um, let's go with this. I'll have to put two Bs here. Create that B line. I'm gonna flop this down there. And I am going to do a fan action first. I'm gonna go here, produce some honey, baby. And then I'm gonna do some sales. I will do a forage action. I'll scoot I here and snag my, a pollen. I don't know. I hope my my I did a lot more orders than you. I hope that's enough to yeah beat you. I don't know if it's gonna be. Um, with my two market actions, I'm gonna sell direct to the market. First, I'll sell two wildflowers, which will get me eight dollars total. It's not the not the most valuable. You're going wholesale. I'm going I'm going specific orders. You're going wholesale. I'm Costco. Costco, <laughs> man. Uh, and now I'm going to sell two acacia, yeah. which is That's six well, a piece, which will be like, a lot of points, man. I don't know. Like, do you know how cheap our hot dogs are? <laughs> <laughs> They're crazy cheap. Okay. okay Mike, sir. Mike, sir. Mike. Got it. Selling. Selling. Sold. Jeez. Okay. Is that it? I think that's it. Okay, so most cells in a straight line, I have three, uh, most empty cells. I go boop, boop, boop. I only have two. And I only got two, two, so I'm gonna get this. Fuse workers, you have, I believe, five. I have five workers. I have six. That was one thing, I kept getting workers, and I was like, oh, I probably shouldn't be doing this. That, I think, might make all the difference. $20 is a lot of money, man. All right, so then it's just your orders plus your points, of which you got a lot more than me. Orders I don't know if these cash. are gonna overcome this. So I've got nine and seven, so I've got $16 from the cash. Oh, Lordy. So I like to get it all in cash, because yeah. it's more fun that way. <laughs> 20 making change, coloring up. Oh yeah, no, I don't think I'm, I think I'm gonna get destroyed here. Um, oh yeah, no, I got, I th absolutely demolished, I think. Really? Yeah, I think you, I think you crushed me pretty good here. Yeah, you sure did. Well, I have a total of 20, 40, 60, 80, 121 dollars. I have 90. You destroyed Costco, me. baby. <laughs> no, it was just, it was like, I was doing a lot more orders, but you kept doing that, and I was just like. I think it's also important to sell, like, I know in games past, I've gotten really hung up on the contracts, mm -hmm. and I think those are valuable. Like, nine, I got $16 from, from yeah. my 
things, but I think you can selling so direct to the market money, can yeah. be so valuable. But you have to get the you have to you get, have to get, the get your, yeah you have to get you have to because well, then you when I realized I wasn't going to get this one, I was yeah. like oh I mean in the end you still would have won even. This if is I a forty that. point swing right here. So well, actually, that's no, the only difference is that I had one yeah, less B. That's what that's all that was. That couple times where I got too many Bs, I was just like ooh because this this one I think if that went the other way, I think I would have won with that. These are really strong. Yeah, they get they yeah. get there's so much point, so many points. But yeah, you kept doing that. And the last few times you're like, you're like, I'm gonna sell this, this, and I was like 20 points. And I was like, Yeah, dang, that's like three of my orders. Like, holy crap, that's so a lot. So you're like going to specific contracts. I'm just setting up a cart in the yeah. middle of this town square, being like, who wants a five dollar honey? And everyone's <laughs> yeah. like, me. You know? I think if you're going contracts, you need to try and end the game. Kind of speed, it, yeah. Speed which I it. which I did do pretty quickly. I mean, it, it's been a short game ultimately, but like yeah. I was like, oof, I I, I don't think I'm gonna That's win. What yeah, I like you about this game though, because I think it's beautiful me. the way that the the hive builds and everything. Yeah. But it's also pretty quick. Oh yeah, with two players particularly, yeah, it's, nice. it's very fast. Works right. out good. Good game, my good friend. Job. Good job, sir. Uh, these are arthropods, so just know that. So that was. <laughs> Whoa, that was close to my face. <laughs> Our bad, you know. Uh, good game as always, man. Indeed. I love just you this one out. Yeah, I had to dig deep, but I, I saw hey. what you were doing. I was gonna go like everything I was gonna do. You started doing, so I was like, just start wholesale all day. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. It managed to work out. I was able to to change my course just in time. I feel. I know. Like. It's, it's pretty good. Yeah. So it's yeah. it's good. It's, I like that you can go heavy love, orders. Go heavy, just straight yeah. wholesale market selling. I love Absolutely. it. And I love the the action selection system of like you don't trigger something until you complete a sell. Yes. And that might have many actions. You might want to build for like, oh, I'm not going to do this thing face with the action facing in. I'll use it for the next turn. Well, and, and also like, trying to make your cells work for the certain kind of honey that you want. Exactly. Two is like it's another there's little puzzle. Puzzly. But the puzzles are not difficult. But they're all there's a bunch of them there, and it's it's a really fun, satisfying, satisfying yeah. for sure. So that was Honey Buzz. If you enjoy oh, watching nice. us play games, check us out live at Twitch, twitch.tv slash the Brothers Murph. We play games multiple times a week. We, we interact do. with the chat heavily. So if you ever want oh, to yeah. see us and hang with us for an evening. Twitch.tv slash the Brothers Murph is the place to go. I promise if you feel like you're too old for Twitch, you are not. You are not. Go check it out today. There's a lot of great board gamers doing stuff over there. Indeed. Boom. If you want to see us play any of the games behind us or any other games you want to see us pick up, throw us down in the comments below. Oh. Um, until next time, I think that's it. I'm Nick. I'm Mike. We're the Brothers Murph. We'll see you later. See you at the game house. Oh, snap. That's right. You're listening to a, a bumper for a video right now. Don't forget that this game is broken as... <laughs> Not what I'm doing right now, but I'm doing a this Brothers Murph video. <laughs> I'm a professional voiceover artist. If you can't tell, this is the sultry tunes of Mike the Murph. The Brothers Murph are sponsored uh, with their season five by Restoration Games, <laughs> Lucky Duck Games, and Board Game Geek. And they chose us specifically because we're so smooth with our bumpers. Over there to the right, you can see some other videos for us to check out of us that you're checking out you get it the point is is you can subscribe for more of this sweet sweet voiceover just be lucky i'm not doing asmr right now because it'd go about as good as this bumper is right now we love you all so much make sure you check out our patreon and thumb this video up and comment for the game you want to see us do a playthrough of next and also make sure you give this video a double thumbs up if you enjoy mike and the magic tones doing bumper voiceover oh yeah